Now, during a benchmarking visit of uh, Karamoja leaders to Imyoga Sakos in Ankole region, uh, differences between Karamoja and Ankole Imyoga Sako groups is, uh, has been noticed to be pivotal for fostering community empowerment in Kato Corridor regions, as we hear more in this report. In a transformative benchmark peer exchange visit to the vibrant Ankole region, a delegation of visionary leaders from Karamoja in Yoga Sako, representing 11 districts including Kotido, Moroto, Napak, Nakapiripirit, Karenga, Abim, Kabong and Nabila Tuk, has made a clear resolution. United in purpose, they have played to spearhead an enlightening campaign, urging communities to embrace the government's Yoga savings and credit cooperatives, as the cornerstone of community economic empowerment. That first we are supposed to go back on aggressive training of members, teach our members on uh, mobilization, on uh, uh, leadership in their groups, on transparency issues, accountability. The five-day study tour, facilitated by the Microfinance Support Center, served as a bridge between the two Kato Corridor regions, fostering an invaluable sharing of experiences on the Mioga program. The aim is to amalgamate the strength and insights of Western Uganda's well-organized Emyoga circles with their counterparts in Karamoja. Most of the members on those circles have learned that they are very, very active in savings. I really uh, thank His Excellency for this uh, support. So in addition to that, we have learned how to grow the circles. I have learned the how we generate money to the group. We believe with what we have gotten from Western Uganda, we're going to transform also our circles down there in Karamoja sub-regions. The District Resident Commissioner Napak, Dennis Okori, acknowledged the advanced organizational structures of Western Uganda's Emyoga circles. My urge to Emyoga circle leader, this is our program. We must own the circles. The circles are for us. It is not a circle for the government. Let us build our circles, let us mobilize membership, let us increase and make sure that money, economic empowerment reaches out to all uh, persons in the community. In this journey of growth, learning from both, successes and failures is paramount. During the expedition, a senior North constituency's producer dealer in Yoga Circle's success was something Karamoja's leaders eagerly absorbed, promising to invest in bulk trading and producing high quality goods, empowering local farmers to thrive. Circles have actually are producing value addition products, and I think this is very impressive, and I think it's something that we have learned here. Take it as their own. It's through ownership that they will be able to go forward. So that they are able to expand associations, to grow the share capital. I'm going to mobilize most members to join what? The circle. With seven associations and 2,000 active members, the circle's treasurer, Rehema Namatovo, highlighted the transformative impact of their approach to value addition in grains, elevating the economic status of farmers and an empowered community. The Karamajong circle leaders, I emphasize on love for their circle, Farmers get other services like in diversification. The journey towards prosperity in Karamoja is now filled with inspiration and purpose as these leaders bring back the tools for change and a vision for a brighter economic future. Mary Namkose, Robert Waita, UBC News.